Mm -hmm. Not right now. Got to fix it. Yeah. Good luck once you get out there. <laughs> Matt's in a mood this morning. Gosh, he's so grumpy. Good morning, everybody. It's Chris from Out West with Chris. Out today on the Delta at Paradise Point, fishing with my buddy Bet, and fishing with Matt from Yankee Diggers Outdoors. And he's in a sh <laughs> Your fish finder went off? Yeah. It's gonna be one of those days. <laughs> really? That's a good start. So, Chris, you're the only one who's got a fish finder right now. You got a fish finder? No, oh, I forgot my battery. Oh. <laughs> it's one of those days today. Okay, I'll tell you what's up. <laughs> it's it's cold right now. Yeah. 53 degrees. There's a free crankbait right there if anybody wants it. A free crankbait. I I don't want to slip and get out on this really mossy stuff. <laughs> but there's one right there. Yeah, he usually doesn't catch fish when we fish together. Oh, uh, we got cleaned up today. I don't know. <laughs> I'm kind of fine with it. <laughs> Cause like, I know he's a better fisherman than me, but I think he has doubts. <laughs> we discovered a shipwreck. Um, actually, there are a ton of shipwrecks and stuff like this, debris like this out um, <clears throat> in the Delta in various spots. So it's not uncommon to see uh, boats. Um, a lot of times they're boats that may have been in a um a slip somewhere that somebody totally forgot about doesn't ever come and take them out and visit them and um they might break loose um from the slip at the dock and then um you know in a storm and then they kind of ride the tides for a while and uh, end up crashing sometimes they just get abandoned because people don't want to deal with them um so they're they're all over out here. It's kind of interesting. Fish out! Oh, I lost it! Damn it! I lost one. So, just a quick little update. We've been out here for three hours and nobody's caught a fish yet. So, um, I've tried spinner baits, tried um, crank baits. Seal's right behind me. Huge. Can you see that? Freaking sea lion just chilling right by me. Hard to catch fish when they're around. <laughs> oh man. It's 
a good fish. Is it? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, I'm glad we came back out. Well, he's okay. Fought really well, dude. Yeah, that other one did too. Huge fan of sea ice shark. Sharp. Yeah, sharp teeth. No, on the wa on a wacky rig. So my first fish of the day. We almost called it quits, but uh, we're back out after it. So nothing huge, but Mwah! gonna kiss him. Mwah! Gonna kiss him again. Mwah! Gonna kiss him three times and then throw him in the water. It's pretty calm over here in general. What about it? Well, it's just a minor breeze. Right. Fish out! Man, these guys are fighting. Bad. All right, let's um, put this guy back. He's not huge, but um, I am digging that I'm finally catching fish. So there we go. Just rest up for a minute. Huh? Okay. Okay, momentum. You okay? You okay? Keep your nose in.
<laughs> that was pretty awesome. It was the first time ever I felt like I might be in danger in a car. Really? She just sit up so damn high, dude. That was some of the worst wind I've ever paddled in. It wasn't for very long, but that was pretty bad. <laughs> that was bad. Today's just been this, it's been a day, that's for sure. Fished a lot. I caught two stinking fish. This guy caught one, one stinking fish. That was a grind. Check out Yankee Tankers Outdoors. Uh, be sure to check out Bet's channel too, even though he left early. Smart. He's probably <laughs> glad he did. That's it for me. Hit that subscribe button and uh, be sure to check out a couple of my other videos, which are down below. Thank you for watching. Thanks for getting out west with Chris.